Hi kids, Mr. Chris here. How's everybody doing? I'm here with another fun science project for today. Let's see here, what can we do today? Oh, well, remember what happened last time. Last time we did a video, I tried to make, a, well, when we did a science project, I was trying to make a mint flavored soda, right? Okay, well first, I'm sure you guys are asking, what does he have on his head? Well, Hunter here is wearing ears. Emily has her bow on. I didn't have anything but this, so I thought, well, I, you know, that way we're all wearing something, right? Is this fun? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Well, so that, that's why I have this on my head. Now, back to our science project. <clears throat> why does candy and soda make a lot of bubbles? We're going to find that out. I have something else here, though, first that will make bubbles. But we're going to use water. Ooh, I'm thirsty. I'm thirsty. <laughs> here I go. No. I have to save it for the project, don't I? All right, fine. So what I'm going to do first to show you how things react, like a chemical reaction, I'm going to pour some water in this bowl right here. Remember, kids, don't try this at home. I am a professional. Whoa, look at that. And if I spill this, it's going to be very cold. Oh, OK, it's splashing me in the eyes. OK, but I'm fine. <clears throat> OK, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Now, what I have here is something that people would take for a headache or a tummy ache. It is called, it's like an Alka-Seltzer, which is like an effervescent tablet. Now this tablet by itself, I'm gonna eat this, this is medicine, remember? Right, but what happens if I drop it in this water? Can everybody see this? I'm gonna count to three, you guys count to three, I'm gonna drop it in the water. Ready? One, a three, a two, wait a minute, I messed up, <laughs> sorry. One, two, three, and what is happening? Can you guys uh, out there see that? What is happening? It is bubbling. Why is it bubbling? Because it's mint. Is it, well, this isn't mint. This is a medicine. But what's happening is there's a reaction between the medicine and the water, making it fizz and bubble. But while it's doing that, medicine is going into the water. But we're not going to use that. That's just to show you. There are a lot of fun science projects. Now, I'll, I'll do some more with these tablets another day. I'm just kind of showing you guys what a reaction does. Look, it's kind of jumping around in there. Can everybody kind of see what's happening there? Uh -huh. Yeah, that's kind of cool, isn't it? Well, <laughs> what would happen if we throw a Mentos in there? No. <laughs> we gotta find out, don't we? <laughs> yes. Here we go. Wait a minute. What happened? Oh, I didn't open the bag, did I? <laughs> oh, okay. Guess I need to eat more cream beans. <laughs> this is hard to open. I need to eat more broccoli and celery and. Uh, uh, oh. I'm having a bad day, but I'm okay. It's fine. We're okay. We're going to continue. Uh, okay. Thank you, Hunter. Okay. Here's what I want you guys to do. I want to open one of these vents, and when I say one, two, three, I'm going to have you and Emily put a Mentos in this water, and let's see what happens. Are we ready? Ready, Emmy? You want to put one in? Okay, on the count of three. Ready? One, two, three. Drop it in and see what it does. <laughs> Oh, yeah, oh. <laughs> well, it is kind of bubbling, but not a lot. Can you guys see that a little bit? Sort of, kind of. Okay, well then my question is, what if I use some soda? <laughs> oh, first, let's open up another Mentos here. Here we go. One for you, and one for you. Hang on, we'll put it in the soda and see what happens. All right, I'm gonna pour some soda in this bowl. We might get a better picture of what happens. Now, remember, kids, don't try this at home. I am we a professional. Are home, Daddy. Well, oh yeah, we are home. What am I thinking? Well, let's go ahead and try this. On the count of three, you kids can put the Mentos in the Coke in the bowl. Ready? One, two, three. Drop them in. Nothing's gonna happen because it didn't really happen with that, and it didn't. Well, kind of. Why is it not doing it with that so much? as it did in the bottle. There is a difference, isn't there? Well, there's a couple of different things going on scientifically here. Last time I put some mint in my bottle, I got wet. I mean, it went everywhere. I'm not gonna get wet today. Oh, no, no, no. Not gonna get wet today. It didn't really do much. It bubbled a little and it quit. Well, this soda was already had been opened and it's cold in the refrigerator, but Oh no, what do I have here? Cold. I have a fresh warm bottle that's never been opened. 
it has more carbonation in it and it's diet coke because the diet coke seems to work better it, oh you know what i'm scared about something about this we have a light above us don't we probably not a good idea to do this inside so why don't we go outside for this one everybody ready to go outside hey let's go outside we'll be right back